If you guys don't like and subscribe in the next one second, you'll see this page again on Roblox. Don't risk it. Okay. Hello there and welcome back to another video. Today we're here in Roblox. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can go ahead and make Roblox shirts in 2022. Throughout my time on Roblox, I've made quite a few, well, qu quite a lot of shirts, actually. Um, in today's video, I'll be showing you guys exactly how you can make Roblox shirts um, for completely free as well. So make sure you go ahead and watch all the way up until the end. As well as that, guys, I'm on this channel. I'm actually trying to hit 100,000 subscribers before the end of the year. If you guys would subscribe to the channel, that would be greatly appreciated. And also, if you want to go ahead and... Um, well, well, first things first, guys, are you fed up with watching YouTube videos for Roblox codes? Well, I've got a solution for that. That is, in fact, rblxcodes.com. On the website, you can find out game codes, music codes, and guides. There is tons of stuff in there that you guys have to check out. Overall, we have codes for over 300 Roblox games. So, if you guys need a code for a game, it will be there. Anyway, guys, I guess let's just go ahead and get into this video now. So, guys, to make Roblox shirts, first things first, you're going to want to go ahead and come to the Create tab. Once you are here, go ahead and go down to um where is it shirts over here guys now you have came down here what you're gonna want to go ahead and do is wait for it to load which i don't know why it's taking so long but anyway guys you're gonna want to go ahead and click on this over here do you um did you use the shirt template if not download it here so click on download it here guys and now we have the shirt template what you're gonna want to go ahead and do is click on right click and um, right click this item and save image as save this as whatever you want just make sure you guys can find it i'm gonna do that right now so guys once you have downloaded that image you're gonna want to go ahead and come to this website it's called pixlr um if you have a different photo editing editing software for example photoshop or paint.net i think that's one of them as well and um, you guys can go ahead and use that if you're more for, more familiar um with that then what i want to show you guys today but this is completely free and um, you're going to want to go ahead and come to this website i'll link it down below in the description it's pixlr.com and click on launch pixlr e so we're going to go ahead and open the image over here i've actually just um I've actually had this image over here. However, guys, I'm, right, okay, this is more what I'm used to. So, guys, once you've um, actually uploaded the image, you'll see that when you go over here, you'll see open image, find it where you've saved it. And now, guys, it'll look something like this. Okay, so what I'm going to go ahead and do here, on the right, I'm going to select this um, marquee um, select over here. I'm going to quickly scroll down a bit um, right now. And... What we're going to go ahead and do first, we're going to fill it in the front. So as you guys can see right now, um, on the image, we have the different um, sections of the shirt. You'll see where each section actually is placed on the avatar. For example, here, it says front, and this is going to be appear on the front of our shirt. The F bit over here, that is the front arms over here, guys. L, left, R is right back up and down self-explanatory okay guys once you're over here i'm just going to show you guys a basic shirt today i'm not going to um show you guys with patterns because um this is just like a bit of a beginner's tutorial right now guys however what i'm going to go ahead and do right now we're going to color in the front bit so make sure you guys have this selected on the right the marquee select and you're going to want to go ahead and um drag it all the way over the front also um i recommend if you guys want to, I'd probably drag it a bit more over the front, guys. Um, so you have all of the red bit selected. Um, now we have this. We can actually um, create a new layer. So click on the plus bit button over here. And we're just going to create an empty layer right now. So, guys, still we have the marquee select button. And now, guys, we're going to want to go ahead and go to the draw feature to the left over here. And now we have a brush. Click on brush, guys. And actually, we're going to click on... Um, this one over here this 100 brush guys what this is going to go ahead and do um it's not going to have like a fade effect to the side it'll be one solid color which is kind of what we want and we'll also fill it in quite um quite quick as well guys so over here we're going to fill it in any color we want you can drag and create any color you want by cl clicking on the color picker to the side over here guys i'm going to pick this nice little blue um front Thing over here and we're just gonna want to go ahead and drag this all the way over the front so guys now the front section has been covered um and as you guys can see this blue bit will now if we were to upload it on roblox will cover the front area um i think i have actually drawn drawn a bit um over the down section so i'm just going to quickly delete that by clicking on delete on my keyboard whilst highlighting that with a marquee tool so guys you can do multiple patterns on this let's say if you want like a um a spotty jumper or whatever um you can go ahead and select black over here um and go back into this you can resize the brush by clicking down on the side and then you guys can go ahead and create 
Uh, we could like smiley face, <laughs> smiley face up there, guys. There we go. So you can make whatever patterns you want. What I'm gonna go ahead and do right now, I'm gonna go ahead and select this again, and I'm gonna go ahead and make the back and the front the same color. So guys, now I'm gonna go ahead and select this color again, and I'm gonna go ahead and color this in. Um, I see I have actually not co um, covered the whole of the back bit over here, so I'm gonna quickly select that bit a little bit more, and we're just gonna go ahead and redraw through that, guys. It doesn't matter if we go and draw let's say if i draw on the white um over here on the outline this won't come into my roblox um shirt so let's just say if i do a little smile i don't well if i just do like a smiley face over here this smiley face won't be appear on the shirt it'll only be what is here that is covering the template pieces so guys i have the back um and the front now i'm just gonna make a sad face on the back guys um i'm not gonna lie this shirt's terrible but it's just showing you guys the basics and how to make a roblox shirt and with practice you guys can start making some good shirts and maybe get them quite popular on the car um avatar shop guys um in the catalog anyway over here we're gonna go ahead and color um this a different color right now I'm gonna do a nice little blue you can also do a gradient thing um right okay so guys i'm used to photoshop however um also guys you can use the fill button this is probably a bit easier you can just click on fill have your color to the bottom left over there and that'll fill the area that you, you have selected um i actually don't want to fill it that color i want to fill it um a bit of a darker color of there guys so we'll fill that in a darker color right now say you guys want a little gradient what a gradient is it's a change in color from one color to another so i want to highlight this left thing over here and we're actually going to add a gradient for this guys the gradient is going to be from black to um light so over here guys i'm going to go ahead and apply the gradient um i'm not too sure how i apply gradients in this um add um md we'll try this guys um right okay so gradient there we go guys okay so guys, what we're going to want to go ahead and do is actually draw an up arrow um, over here. As you guys can see right now, it goes from um, light to dark. Or we can draw down, which will go from light to dark um, down here. So whatever direction you want, you can draw of that, guys. As long as you have the area that you want coloring in selected, it'll only cover that area, guys. So we're going to go ahead and make another gradient over here. This is just some of the different things that you guys can actually do over here, guys. Let's go ahead and do that right now. A cool... To be fair, guys, that's, that's looking quite good. Um, and down, what I'm going to go ahead and do right now, I'm just going to make it suit the theme of light to dark. And I'm just going to fill this in black right now, guys. Um, Where is the fill button? Here it is. So, yeah, guys, I'm going to fill that in a nice little black color right now. So, there we go, guys. That is our, that's the top bit of our shit. However, guys, over here, we need to actually fill in the arms. So, let's go ahead and do that right now um so guys i think what i might as well do i'm just going to go ahead and fill this all in as a gradient um over here guys so if i want to highlight this whole thing i can just select this as a gradient of course you guys can highlight and change the individual things if you want but i'm just going to go ahead and speed things up and make this a whole gradient right now guys there we go let's go from actually i want to do the other way so from light to dark there we go guys okay so now what i'm gonna go ahead and do i'm gonna click on file and i'm gonna save it. i'm gonna save this file to whatever you'll find it as just save it to a place where you know you'll find it so i'm gonna go ahead and do that right now um i recommend saving it as a jpeg to be fair guys and put the quality as whatever you want um it doesn't really matter too much guys but i'll just keep it as this and click on save as so now pick a place where you want to save it so now i've saved that file i'm gonna come back over here on the create si shirt section i'm gonna click on choose file and i'm gonna choose that file that we have just made so guys i have just chosen that the file um and now guys name it as whatever shirt you want i'm just gonna name it as tutorial um shirt over here guys sadly now there is a 10 robux cost for actually uploading shirts guys but i'm just gonna click on confirm over here to show you guys for the tutorial so guys as you can see right now we have the tutorial shirt it won't show up as anything in the image over here because it does actually need to be moderate moderated by roblox it'll take a few minutes to moderate guys if you want to go ahead and sell this shirt and go ahead and right well click on the settings button over here configure now guys go ahead and go to sales and also add a description um and click on item for sale over here and set it to whatever price you want i might as well just set it for five robux guys if you want to buy this i'll leave a link down below in the description i don't really think many of you guys will want to buy this shirt but um i'm going to quickly wait over here and i'll see you guys back once the finished 
finished product has been uploaded to Roblox. And maybe we'll actually see here. Yeah, guys, we have. Um, actually, I want to take off. Right, that's annoying. I have an arm, but we're going to go ahead and hopefully see it like this, guys. But yeah, this will be our completed shit. Um, right, okay. Looks like it's going to load in a little bit. I'll meet you guys back once it's eventually loaded. And to be fair, guys, I might as well just get it from changing that so as you guys can see right there here is our shirt not gonna lie guys the gradient the gradient's looking quite cool if you want to go ahead and upload like logos like an adidas logo or a nike logo to, to your shirt or like a picture you can do so um in the photo editor editor as well and just file um and actually open image or you can copy and paste it in the image in over here um and you can add it to wherever you want on the shirt guys so yeah if you want to go ahead and do that make your shirt a bit better but yeah guys that's how you can go ahead and make a shirt on roblox um i hope you all did enjoy this video if you did make sure to like and subscribe to show some support and peace out